doing a mukbang. Does everyone want to introduce themselves? No. No? Hi. No? <laughs> okay, we have Papatia here. Papatia, Juno, Hi. and Luna, <laughs> the OG squad. Who are you? Yeah. I'm Salama. Oh, do you? <laughs> do you yeah, okay. Do you have an intro? Okay, okay. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Salongo and we're doing a Korean cuisine mukbang today. And we're also doing Am I the Asshole on Reddit. Watch your mouth. Because there's a lot of assholes. Well, YouTube does allow some profanity. Oh, okay. Some. Some. There are limits. Asshole's not that bad. No. Yes, no. Oh, we're debating already. <laughs> I know, right? Oh. Um, and we plan to debate. Like, we're, I plan to get heated today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we're not going to be friends by the end of this. I already don't like any of these people. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> you really took that. I'm joking. I'm joking. Oh, you're going to open that? I'm trying to open Okay, thank you. Okay. Um, hit the subscribe button and... So we're just gonna get started. We have a bunch of jajangmyeon. I feel like an idol showing my cake. <laughs> Tomoki? Tomoki? Um, maybe that's how you say it. Inoki mushrooms. I bought these just. Well, we got these just for me. I don't think anyone else is gonna try them. I'll, I'll, I'll try. try. Okay, okay. And then we have this cool like flour bread. You wanna go closer? Sexy. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, and finally, first little. Some gummies. And then seaweed. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Seaweed. Yeah. Important. Can't forget. Okay, I'm gonna take one. Did you taste it? Is it good? It is good. It's mm -hmm. like strawberry coconut milk. Just like how <laughs> it's very good. I like the little, there's like coconut gels. Like oh, and jellies. Beauty guru. Oh, wait, my bad. My bad. <laughs> there's little jellies in there. You didn't even show the label. Oh, I didn't. Sorry. So Copyright? No, I'm joking. No. I'm um, sponsored. No, I'm joking. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> oh, oh. Her. Okay, feast. I'm excited. Feast in. I'm oh, scared too. Really? I don't know why. Really Aren't you guys hungry? First spice is hungry. I have a hair in here. Oh. Wait, is it my hair? I don't know. It's short. Okay. Um, it was, it was Interesting. <laughs> I didn't get any water and this is a bad idea. Is it spicy? Is it good? It's good. Oh, let me, mm. let me actually. It's not too bad. I can do it. Yeah. I like it. Oh. Really? It's good. <laughs> This is Am I the asshole for snapping at a girl because she always takes a bite from my phone? What? A bite? <laughs> a bite from Yeah, that's what they say. What? Wait, read it. Okay, so Hold they're up. like, so I feel like I'm an asshole for this, but let's see. There's a girl, Ollie, and she in my 19 female uni, who used to be our friend, not my friend, but she was in a, a, like the friend group. At first, I thought she was shy and introverted. After some time, our friend group got divided because we were separated into two classes. Now we used to, to ask Ollie to be with us because the people he was friends with, who are also part of our friend group, went to another class. But as the time went by, she started acting weird. One thing she did was, I bought something from Canteen, and at first she just kept staring at it. And then sometime after that, when I did not offer a bite, she just said, can I have some and bit into my food? Ew. I was disgusted because I hate it when I'm eating with <laughs> something and someone takes a bite. It just disgusted me. I've never eaten food that was bit by my siblings. <laughs> the next day, she took a sip from my cold coffee. And one day I brought rice and I told her that if she wants it, she can have it in her own little tin separately. But she refused to do so and kept eating from my lunchbox. Do you want to scoot in? I'm not in the frame. Alright, okay. Alright. Okay. 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 Ew. Okay, okay. Ollie is disgusting and you're not the asshole. No, I feel like. Sorry. Personally, I don't do that. Like, if people ask me to stop, I'll stop. Like, valid. Mm -hmm. But, like, I am wanting other people's food. Like, that's, like, yeah, valid. And I, I 
Okay, you're not the asshole because you allowed them to eat it. You just like set boundaries and setting boundaries is good. Right? But we're not done yet. Oh, we're not done. Oh, okay. oh yeah, Whoa. there's still more. <laughs> One day, me and my friend were talking about how depressing it can be when someone <laughs> takes, like, drops for one academic year mm -hmm. and Ollie just snapped and said, You guys know nothing about depression. Mm -hmm. Just ask me what it's like to have depression. And no, guys, Ollie is not suffering from depression. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. But one of her family members is, which is unfortunate. Mm -hmm. I hope she gets well. But she started getting even more weird and weird. Day by day to the point our whole friend group started avoiding her. Ooh, okay. She knew that we were isolating her, but she kept clinging on to us. Um, like whenever I'm saving a seat for my friend, she would sit beside me when other seats are empty. And after some time, I started saying no to her because I was never that close. Why should I sit with her when I think we don't click? She did the same thing, the same food thing a few days ago and just snapped and told her. I snapped and I told her that like, how can she not listen when I've told her multiple times that I don't like people biting into my food because I feel oh. disgusted when people put saliva on it. Valid, valid. <laughs> now, some of my friends are saying that I was harsh on her. So, oh. am I the asshole? No. No. That's not, yeah. Yeah, no. There's no Boundaries, way. people. Boundaries. You she set clear boundaries. Yeah. And she was like, <laughs> fuck no. And then she waltz right over. <laughs> <laughs> no, but like, how can I don't understand how someone can do that and not think it's disgusting. Mm -hmm. How sells. old are these people? Like, that was 19. Like, 19. No, they're not. Mm -hmm. no way. She said they're 19 female. Oh my god. They're in uni. You, that's like a middle school ass. Like, yeah, that's like so. Do you think it's flirting? <laughs> no, I kind of do. Like, really? I was thinking that in the beginning. Yeah, like insisting to like share food and like your food and like. Mm -hmm. Especially like I'll give you some, but like eat your own, don't eat mine, and then insisting that you eat that person's like it's a little flirty. It's a little, hmm. it's a little flirty. It's so weird. Why? Why was the title "Bite from My Phone"? I don't understand. I don't understand that. <laughs> no. <for real. laughs> All right, this is kind of. Do you read that? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, come on. Am I the asshole if I don't tell my siblings that our dad is gonna put down a family doll? <laughs> yes. <laughs> The title. Yes! Oh my god. Ah! Yes! yes. How, uh, how old are the siblings? Mm. Read it, read it. The title pretty much explains the situation. <laughs> Dog has always had health issues since she's um, since he was a puppy. He was a blue healer, he's one years old. All his health issues have been mainly with eating, nutrition, and weight, which has which nothing has helped. Mm. Um, currently, right now, the only options are to get him surgery, which will not cure his health issues, or to have him put it, or to put him down. They talked to a couple of people that are vets, and they said that putting him down would be the best option. Oh my god! So today they're going to end up doing that. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just crying. Oh okay, okay. <laughs> Only part is that only one of my siblings know. I have five other siblings and he has only told one. I feel like we should tell them all so they could spend time with him before they leave yes. to do it. But no one has told them and I understand it might be better to not tell them. Yeah. So the dog just randomly disappears one day? No, like, <laughs> like your what? dog dying of natural causes versus your dog dying because you purposely put them down. Those but, are two different things. And if a kid knows that you purposely put that dog down, they're gonna look at you differently versus that dog died of natural causes. No, they're not. If you just tell them, like, yeah, look, little pup has been having some health issues and. We so gotta go off and kill him versus little pup had some health issues and he died. No. Like, yeah, those are two different things. It's more humane to let the dog not live in pain. I'm not saying keep the dog alive. I'm saying tell the kid. <laughs> I'm saying Wait, tell the kid that the dog died naturally, not how, that you killed the dog. How old are the kids? I was not like, they assuming, say. If they, Yeah, like. Okay, if it's like a- so When I was in middle school, my mm -hmm. cat had a blood issue where they either got like really expensive surgery that probably wouldn't have helped or they got put down or we chose to put them down. And like mm -hmm. obviously I'm an only child, like I was aware of it, but like yeah. the way that my parents handled it was really bad. So like knowing that, first of all, story. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> when we were putting her down, they were like, hey, do you want to hold her? Mm -hmm. So I was holding her as I like injected the like put down stuff and she like died in my arms. Yeah. So like, mm -mm. it can be pretty bad. I'm just saying, tell like a like, kid, it's like, your cat's gonna die and, you know, 
you're probably gonna be like you're gonna feel like you're part of killing them, you know? So like it's better to just be like one that you put the dog down and then when the dog dog gets put down, go to the kid and be like, hey, your dog like passed away. Like it was So lie. Yeah, lie. Like don't yeah. It really depends on how old the siblings are. If yeah. the siblings are like if old can, enough. Yeah, if, if they can handle enough, it, yeah. tell them. But if they yeah. can't, then don't like I don't know, kinda sounds like they're all adults to me. I don't know, it sounds like they're young. So yeah. Asshole if older, not the asshole if younger. Mm. There you go. Yeah. I agree. Oh, this is interesting. Mm. Oh. Oh, it's a lot of ones. Yeah. Mm. So probably my future in-laws abusive narcissists. Okay. <laughs> I feel like that's gonna be a common story. Yeah. That's a yeah. Mm. That, that's a name. That's something you can call someone. Okay. Me. So this person is 20. They're female. Oh, They're fiance. Yeah, their fiance is 27 and also female. Okay. They're dating, married soon. Happy like Happy Pride Month. Yeah, Happy Pride Month. <laughs> Give you all. Yeah. <laughs> um, they're waiting until September. They're talking about the wedding. Um, and the fiance mentioned that they don't want their brother on the guest list. Mm. Mm. Well, that's valid. Like, maybe homophobic. Mm. Her, well, mm. Maybe he sucks. Her brother is 17 female, autistic. Still recovering from a brain injury from football and has severe impulse control issues mm. that cause him to make sudden outbursts, physical touch, and like physically touch people. Mm. He's gotten so much better recently, but there are days and times where he seems perfectly fine, but still needs constant attention. And you can't predict when he's going to be okay or if it's a really bad day. Mm. So the fiance is like worried that having them there will make other guests uncomfortable and like cause the ceremony to go on too long. Mm. Mm. And the person who's writing this has POTS, oh. which makes standing and walking not difficult. just difficult, but like dangerous. Mm -hmm. So they've timed the ceremony based on their bad days. So the person tells their fiance that it's her family and she decides who comes or not, mm -hmm. or not and then, you know, just like let her know what the decision is. Mm -hmm. And she's like 100% sure to not bring the brother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But then she got nervous over telling her parents so, the person writing it told the parents and the brother. No, she put it on her fiance. No, that's so bad though. You no, can't do, you that, can't to do someone. that to someone. Yeah, why would you? Why would you do that? <laughs> mm -mm. Mm. Pass. So they tell. Pass. <laughs> pass. Pass. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> um, they tell her parents because of certain concerns. Brother cannot come, and her parents make a fuss <laughs> over them paying the venue. Because, like the brother's not coming, so they make a fuss. Oh, uh, like we're not gonna pay for it if he's not coming. Yeah, like like we're paying for the venue, so why can't he come? Yeah. Uh, Ooh, they're like taking ownership of the wedding. Oh, okay. And then they offer to pay them back with interest by the end of the week. With interest. Oh, with damn. interest. You're gonna make your daughter-in-law pay interest. <laughs> uh uh. Her brother took it okay-ish, assumed it was the end of it, but then fast forward to her cousin's uh, graduation. The parents started drama over us by not accommodating our little, little survivor. Mm. Mm -hmm. And then the fiance breaks down crying in the bathroom. Mm -hmm. I ask her what she wants to do and she says to just invite brother. And I ask her if that's what she really wants and she says that doesn't matter. So I, yeah. So I snap, I turn to her parents and shout, What the <laughs> is wrong with you? <laughs> When I lay into them, they snap back. Emmy's always too emotional. Mm. I'm mm. seeing red and I just decided to get the last dig in and say, well, I, well, she's not an abusive narcissist, narcissist like you two. Mm. And then collect, collected my fiance from the bathroom and tell her she has to drive because I'm going to pass out. <laughs> mm. So they don't know if they're the asshole, but they know that, you know, the parents are terrible. Yeah. And they were just really pissed off. Okay, so to summarize, the person writing it, so the fiance of the person writing it mm -hmm. didn't want their brother to come. Mm -hmm. Yes. But then the person writing it told the parents that they didn't want the brother to come. Because the per fiance, because the fiance like, did not want to do it. it. Yeah. And then so the parents were like, oh no, I'm not paying for the wedding. No, they were, they were more like. They were more like, we paid for the venue. Yeah, so like, we gotta decide. So like, oh, yeah. Okay. And then, 
You're not the asshole. But then the person yelled at the parents. Okay, I think they're not the asshole. I think they should have like they shouldn't have said all that to the parents. Eh. Mm. Someone gotta put them in their place. I mean, like, true, but like, I think it, they're not the asshole because it's like it's your wedding. Like you can be as selfish as you want to be. Yeah. You know, to your yeah. and your partner's day. So. That's valid. The parents. Were but the good. question is, are they an asshole for calling their parents abusive narcissists? I think I think that was a little far. You can you can convey that you're angry. Yeah, and they're convey calling someone abusive. There are better words. Like, yeah. yeah. Um, it's not a word that should be used lightly. Mm -hmm. There's an edit. <gasps> mm, apparently this is relevant. Oh, they're definitely abusive. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> okay, they're they're giving us the details. Okay. You know, um, does anyone want the last mushroom? Go for it. Go for it. No. Okay. Oh, can I try it? Just a small. They're. I didn't season them well. Uh -oh. oh. But you can try not. <laughs> they're good with the noodles. If you have some of the noodles with it. They once locked all the food in the house. And refused to let my fiance eat because she got a C in chemistry. And they felt like she needed to be motivated to get good grades. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah! Oh my god! No! What the fuck? <laughs> no! Not a vibe. Okay, that's definitely abusive. Yeah. Um. Not 100% on them clinically being narcissists, but they were making someone else's graduation about themselves. So I just called it yeah. as I saw it. That's pretty yeah. narcissistic, I yeah. think. Yeah. That is. Oh my god. This is so good. It's really good. Yeah. I, it's it's really literally all I've eaten because I can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> I had some of the noodles, but like otherwise. Honestly, I think that's valid for calling yeah, that. Yeah, so valid. Yeah. yeah. Like now the abuse would make sense. Like. But now you can you you can like embarrass them by calling them that at the graduation. Yeah. You know what I mean? It hits different when you're in front of people. For real. No. Always, always call people out in front of other people. Does anyone else want to read? Do you want to read? Sure. Is it interesting? Such a nice case. Thank you. Yeah. Amazon. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Sponsored. What do I read? Can I read? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Am I the asshole for ruining a birthday party because the planner disrespected me? Hmm. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. okay. How do you ruin? <clears throat> okay. Never mind. What? Uh, yeah. Let's see what's going on here. <laughs> I was recently invited to a birthday dinner for a friend. For context, my friend was a young daughter that lives at her home with her. My friend is a young daughter. <laughs> has a young okay. Oh, has a young daughter. Oh. <laughs> I'm not oh, a child-friendly person. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't like the societal pressure to have and give up my life for them. Mm. Well, that's not mean you have to be rude to other people's kids. Like, anyway, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like being expected to give up my happiness for theirs. I don't like having to watch what I say oh and do Damn. in front of them. Made the last one, sorry. <laughs> and when they have tantrums and meltdowns, I get overstimulated and being around them is just mm. generally That's very valid. tiring for me. Valid, valid. Yeah. The party was a surprise party being organized by a mutual friend, Hannah. Oh, Hannah is Hannah. very well aware of my feelings about children, and when she asked me to help out with the party, I said I would be reminded her, reminded, reminding her how I feel about kids, <laughs> and asked her to make sure that our friend's daughter was somewhere else for the day. Is it a party for the friend with the daughter? <clears throat> Whose party? Who's party? It's the little. It's a. Is it for the the, the friend of the, the yeah the friend of the daughter? Okay, you can't like mm. have a party for someone and not invite their kid if they have a kid. Like, I'll make sure that person's like, kid isn't gonna be there. It like, depends on the setting. Yeah, obviously if it's gonna be like alcohol and stuff, but like. Like if you're just at like a picnic, I get it. Yeah. But also if you just want an adult birthday and yeah. you invite all adults, it's kind of. But like if. It's complicated because it's a surprise party, like you don't know how that is yeah, gonna feel. Yeah, sure. I and think that's what makes it complicated. She said, you'll be fine. So I assume this meant she'd care, take care of it. She assigned me to bring the decorations and drinks. The morning of the party, I asked her to clarify that our friend's daughter was out of the house. And Hannah said that the child would be there and that, they, and that we have no right to ask the kid to leave her own house. I was baffled that Hannah was prioritizing this kid, who obviously doesn't own the house. I was shocked. <laughs> shocked that there was a kid in the house? <laughs> Just tell it. Tell it. I'm so sorry. Uh, tell the kid 
Yeah, so just stay in your room. Yeah, like, like, <laughs> tell it. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so over our friend being able to have with have fun with her adult friends and blandly ignoring my boundaries, so I didn't go. Right before the party, Hannah and our other friends kept trying to call and text me, but their spamming was making me very anxious. So I put my phone on Do Not Disturb and went to the movies. Mm. Now my phone is being blown up from them and about how I ruined the party by not bringing the things I was I had signed up to bring or by letting anyone know I wasn't going ahead of time. That's valid. I suppose I could have dropped the supplies off or let them know that I wouldn't be going so they could have time to replace the decorations and drinks, but I didn't want to engage with them in that moment because their spamming was stressing me out. And they put themselves in this situation by disregarding my boundary. Am I the asshole? Okay, so yeah, you sound entitled as yeah, you yeah. Um, I also think that you decided before that they before they blew up your phone that you weren't gonna go. Obviously, yeah. so you could have in that moment dropped all this stuff and then and they would have like spammed you. Like, yeah, pretty simple. Um, uh, Over I a mean, kid, like yeah, like, I don't know. That's kind of weird. Uh, oh. Oh. oh yeah, open them, open them. Mmm, that is so good. Oh, that is so good. Uh -huh. Here's my little flower. You have a flower. Thank you. Alright. Yeah. <clears throat> mm. mm -hmm. This is cute. I like it. I love cream bakery. It's so like light and fluffy. Mm -hmm. Not too so sweet. Can I try one? Mm -hmm. How are they? They're good. Mm. They taste really good. So now I'm trying to cookie <laughs> gummies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Delicious. Oh, I showed the back, bro. <laughs> 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 For all beauty gurus, gurus here. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh frick! I don't know. You literally just looked up the beat. The beat. The beat. The No, I feel like some kid stuff. <laughs> you just looked up debate topics. You were fine the first time. It's gonna be like. Oh, God. It's gonna be like, is Jesus Christ real? Like. <laughs> Don't get, don't get started on the religion. I'm not, no, no, no. <laughs> Did you try that flower bread? No. I just don't like a little bit. Take a little bit. Make it happen. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get my coconut milk. Or water. 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 Coco. Yo, yeah, you're eating so much coconut. I mean, drinking. Is that bad? Is coconut bad for you? No, I'm just, just, just saying. Why did you sound so afraid? I have a friend, and every time I eat more than two bananas a day, she gets mad at me because it's bad. What? I didn't know that. I used to eat like three bananas a day until I was really bored. <gasps> Do you know the banana girl on YouTube? Mm-mm. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. What? Then why did you do that? Do you know of this really obscure thing that no one knows about? Yeah, I don't know about it either. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> okay. We're doing would you rather. Ooh, ASMR. Ooh, would you rather. She oh, yeah. Ooh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Watch you. <laughs> Would you rather have the ability to, to see only 10 minutes into the future or 150 years into the future? 150 years? I don't care about really? either. Wait, what was it really? You don't care about the future? Not at all. See 10 minutes of the future or 150 years into the future? See 10 minutes of the future? Why? We're going to still be here. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's the other one. <laughs> I don't oh, like no. I don't like the whole like see into the future thing. It's like, really, just, just let it happen. If like, you know it's really big, one hundred fifty years in the future, you can invest in it early and get really rich. But right. we're going to be dead by then. Well, but, but you're, you're, if you have kids, 
Yeah. You can see go. the life their kids will be living. That's, I don't want to see uh, that. That's sad. Uh, right. So no, I want but then that's a good thing though, because if you see it, oh, then your sad. kids. You can change it. Yeah, you, you can won't. see it in the future again and see if it changes it. Yeah, or like if it's a bad world, like I'll be like, nah, I'm not gonna have Okay, but like if you see it in the future and you're like, oh, it sucks, I should change it, can you? No. Because the future you're seeing is the future. So mm. no matter what you do, you're stuck in it, right? So like butterfly effect won't affect it. Like, it's the idea <laughs> of do you have a set path in the future or do you think you're yeah. able to change yeah. it? Like, are you, yeah. If you're able to change it, then like sure that's a valid question. But what, what do you guys believe in? But like butterfly I feel like I I think you can't change it. You think there's a the set path? The future you see yeah. is the future yeah. that is created through mm -hmm. all your changes despite what you see, you know? Like No, but do you think there's a set path for everyone? Like there's a fate? I don't know if I believe in fate, but I don't believe in a changing future, like the ability to change the future. Right, because that's like a world progression. Mm -hmm. I mean, everyone's gonna do what they do. There's a. <laughs> I'm trying to be deep. This is me. Deep. This, is my, this is my attempt to be deep. No, 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 no. I watched The Matrix, right? And the quote, there's a quote, it was like, you already made the decision, you just have to figure out why you made it. So everything's. Every. No, listen, hold on. Okay. <laughs> Every decision and every choice and everything that happens has already happened. You just gotta get there. That's why I don't care. So it is fate. Yeah. Yeah. You, yeah, believe, you would believe in fate. Yeah. Like everything is. Everything has its course. So do you believe in like the timeline is not linear? It's in a circle. Yeah. I don't know what that means. <laughs> no, no, no. Like, like some people believe that you know time just goes in. The, a linear motion. There's the past, and now we're here, and now there's the future, right? Mm -hmm. Some people believe that time is just happening it all is. at once. I, yeah. yeah. There's a movie I wanted to watch. <laughs> <laughs> there's a movie I wanted to watch. I watched the trailer for it. Um, my dad wants to watch it, so he made me watch the trailer for it more accurately. Um, but <laughs> it like deals with the uh, issue of like, are we moving through time, or is time moving through us? And if mm -hmm. time's moving through us, are we just experiencing all timelines at once? And, like, exactly. That's what I'm saying. I mean, it looked really interesting, and it actually looked like a good movie. I don't even remember what it's called, but, but it looks like, good. <laughs> it's like a weird concept because if time is happening all at once, mm. everything that happened in the past is also happening right now. Yeah, exactly. But it's not. That doesn't make sense. Right, but you're only seeing it through yeah. your own perspective, so you're only seeing the timeline that you're in right now. Mm. Okay, but I'm 17, not 12. <laughs> <laughs> Open your mind a little bit. <laughs> Come on. I don't understand. <laughs> Theoretical. Yeah. Mm. Okay, well, that was deep. I know, it was like a shitty question. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'd rather see 10 minutes or 150 minutes. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Sorry. True love today, win the lottery the next year. Lottery. Lottery. Okay. Lottery. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> scared of lottery winners because they're always targeted. Mm -hmm. okay, but see, you know, the thing is, you get yourself a lawyer yeah. really quickly and you don't tell anybody. Yeah, just don't fucking tell anyone. Don't tell anyone. Someone's gonna call you up. Who? And be like, I want to write an article, an article on you, blah, 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 blah. Okay, but how are they going to know if you don't tell them? Yeah, it? just like change all your numbers. Like, <laughs> this is the like a lot of pay effort. for a free million, you know? Like, You'll have the money to do it. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I don't want to waste all my money on that. <laughs> well, it's not going to be. I mean, new phone number costs, what, zero dollars? Uh, I was, once <laughs> I had this like conversation 20? with my grandparents, we were playing a game, mm -hmm. and they were like, oh, the question was like, oh, what would you do if you won the lottery? And like, I was going last, and they were all saying like, I would donate it to this place, I would donate it to this place. And in my head, I had like planned to say that I would go on like a nice vacation, and when it came down to me, I felt so bad, because everyone was like, Don. I would donate it, I Don. would donate it. Donations, I feel donate like- myself. I feel like I feel like donations and charities are kind of like scams. Like, yeah. Especially like it's hard. A lot of people get away with going. taxes. Yeah. Exactly. That's yeah. what I'm saying. And then it's like even really popular ones like like the BLM. Like it doesn't even go like what the fuck yeah, is it going? Is it going? To, like, it's going to you know like I don't know. Clearly, it's not going to people that need it. What was your answer? Um, lottery. <laughs> I love it. I just want money. I mean, girl. love, like, that can wait. Like, who cares? But, like, money, that love. can't wait. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, my. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, awkward. Oh. <laughs> we stay together. <laughs> um, I would choose love. 
practical. <laughs> I don't know. I just don't. I think it's scary that someone could target you. Like it's a chance. There's a chance. You want the money, but you don't want the like targeting. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna live in fear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that one. Who's there? That one meme. No. What, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> yes, why? I was like, no. The BTS. No. You, Sorry. You like the gym in cold brew in the fridge? No. No. <laughs> are you a part of the army? No. BTS, Saranghae. Please, I have nothing against them. Don't find me, but please. Saranghae. Don't army. find me. Saranghae. I'm scared Jimmy. now. And you can't oh be telling gosh. people I don't like BTS because I will be targeted. Saranghae army. No, we love purple army. Love, <laughs> love army. Saranghae BTS. Love, BTS. <laughs> love RM. I got a slushy. <laughs> I a slushy. <laughs> oh yeah, I got Mang J Hope. Really? Shout out yeah. to J Hope. <laughs> Shop, so mm. certified army now. I bought mm. a chimney, a chimney for a friend. Oh, shout out to Jimin. Guys, <laughs> <laughs> turning to a BTS. <laughs> shout out, mom. That's, that was my favorite. There you go. There you go. <laughs> okay. okay, this is interesting. It's like privacy. So, okay. oh, would you rather have everyone know, like you know, be able to read your thoughts? What the fuck? Or are you no. everyone you know to have access to your internet? History. Internet history. Yeah. Easy. I'm not ashamed you know, of that. I look up really funny stuff. I think it'd be funny. Like mm. some of it's a shaming, but like my I mean, thoughts are worse. So like I mean, we've seen your camera roll. Yeah. <laughs> guys, that's not even that bad, guys. Like fan cam. Leave like... no fan cam. <laughs> <Leave no fan cam. laughs> not that bad, guys. Not that bad. I, I would choose history too. Let's see. I feel like I'm, Sorry, you I'm looking it? up some <laughs> random stuff. Though. Let's go through our history right now. Okay. See. Right now? Yeah. No, search, uh, oh, search history. No, mine is like every time I have a question. Oh, I mine. care if I search history. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Look it up, like, okay. I actively clear my search history. Like, guys. I don't even know what it's. The drama. No, you're drama. really choosing the stuff. <laughs> okay, fine. You want to see? Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. It's not bad. I cleared all the AO AO3 every time I use it, so it's fine. Wow. Wow. Can you mark it? Okay. History archive of our okay. okay, we're good. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Arlington Thank you. Thank you. Arlington, stop. How about 80s album version? Okay. okay. New 80s okay. album. Yeah. 80s. Where to buy K pop yes. album? 80s will be very sad <laughs> to see this. Shout out to 80s. Oh my god. Wait, wait, what's his name? Shout out to Song Hwa. He waved at me and blew me a kiss at K pop. Uh -huh. we're, we're both really big Star Wars fans. So shout out. Let's let's what let's go on a service marathon. Okay, together, but then blow you a kiss. All right, continue. <laughs> oh my god. There's so many shout outs. One second. Oh, where are you going? Okay. Sorry, I'll say. Please don't hurt them. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> um. All right. Um, not monetized um, anymore. <laughs> Jerry, <laughs> Universal respect or unlimited power? Unlimited power. Universal respect. What does power get you? Like, I don't need power. I have no power right now. What's the definition of power? Yeah, like control over others? Yeah. Like, why would I want yeah, that? I want that. You want, you want to be a dictator? <laughs> yeah, Stalin 2.0. Okay, but I'm good in the in the heart. So uh, how are you? Yeah. If you want true power, when you want to get the power, really good in the heart. Yeah. Okay. Trust I don't me. believe you. You don't believe me? No. I want respect. Me too. Me too. Respect is for the winner. Yeah. Respect is for the <laughs> Respect. Bro, you, if you have unlimited, I mean, universal respect, you could just be walking around and never get mugged. That right. would be nice. That's not true. That's a, a fear of mine. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. I'm you not live in New York City. I know, exactly. Bye. RIP, don't do it. That's what I'm going to be like. <laughs> you're back. Yeah. <laughs> you're, gonna, you're gonna have one of those, like, it's like you have a little keychain and then, like, you press a button and it like, becomes like a fucking stick. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Is digital technology making children's lives better? No. Uh, well, hmm, let me think. I've had kids. You have kids? I've had kids. <laughs> I think it's I'm an iPad kid. I think it can be resourceful, but like, I think when it's just unsupervised, it's bad. Like, I like it. Definitely when I'm. Yeah, there has to be limitations. Yeah. For sure. You can't grow up too quickly, that's bad. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I saw that. There you go. Damn, we cleared that bag. Oh, oh, one. No, it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> but 
You know, I grew up with unsupervised internet access and that was a bad thing. Me too. I was only allowed to watch Arthur and was given no phone until high school. Oh my you God. didn't have a phone in middle school? No, it was really embarrassing and I had no social life because of it. So it was meta it was very bad because I had really bad mental health because I had no friends. But Oh okay. I <laughs> you have friends have now. So <laughs> <laughs> I'm here, yeah. Army. Are there any are there are there any pros? Pros? Yeah. To um friends. To limited Oh to limited? To limited um, access. No, because like I <laughs> I have a seniority complex now because of it. Like mm. everyone had all these like pop culture things they could talk about and like mm. had all these like talking points and they could like talk to each other outside of school and I didn't have that. Yeah. So it was hard to maintain me as a friend to other people, which I like fully understand. So I don't really have friends. Um uh so, so I mean, the, it, that's the large largest factor. Yeah, and like they turned out fine. You know, they turn <laughs> out like bad people. Like they're fine. So Yeah, I'm an awful person. Well, I'm not talking about you, I'm talking about <laughs> the people who were my friends in middle school. Um I thought you said you didn't have friends. I didn't really. Boom! I didn't really. Like, we didn't hold in your argument. Court. No, like, they would hang out without me, and, like, they would, like, do all this stuff. I, we were only, like, in school, like, we would talk to each other friends, and that was it. So, like, mm -hmm. outside of school, I went to dance, and I went home, and I studied. And I did not hang out with friends. Well, you're really smart. Yeah, you're really smart. Well, I don't know. You're <laughs> <laughs> smart. No, but, like, I don't know. I feel like it kind of depends, because for me, mm. I did have a lot of access to the internet, but I feel like my lifestyle was kind of the same as yours. Because mm. for some reason, I did not hang out out of school. Yeah, I don't know why. Even though I had like access, I could still communicate. Like I didn't have. Mm. That's I didn't interesting. Go. My friends definitely hang hung out outside of school. Right. So like that was kind of what I looked at. I was like, oh, I'm not being invited to these things because they can't invite me. And it's just too hard for them. No, nah, you're making excuses. They could definitely invite you in person. Yeah, they Yeah, can. but they, okay, maybe they're just bad people. Like, I mean, they're not. They're like nice people, but like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's middle school. It's always bad. It's fine. It's no, Yeah, no, I was the same as long ago. Like, all my, all the people that I talked to were online as a yeah. kid. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, yeah, no, that's. Yeah, it was the same. Like I didn't, I was, I wasn't like on like my school iPad, with, like on Snapchat. Hey guys, let's hate. Like no, it wasn't. It wasn't. <laughs> hey, no, you guys, a <laughs> selfie with my iPad. Like no, we blocked all that stuff on our iPads. Like we couldn't. Oh, I, I had Snap. On your iPad, on your school no, iPad. No, not Instagram on, phone. on my okay, school I was iPad. Okay, on your, on your school iPad. No, I got a phone really early. I'm I really like know. once all I turned my friends double got digits. One. All my friends got one in like fifth grade. I yeah, it was like you have to wait three more years. I, I had one. I had one in sixth grade. My first phone was like a Motorola. Like, <laughs> <laughs> nope. It was like a light, like piss green, like case. It was really funny. <laughs> I <missed> that <laughs> Maybe you should get that. I could flip. I know. I really want to flip phone. Um, yeah, phone. I really do too. Because like, imagine you're mad at somebody. Bye. <laughs> and you're like, yeah. <laughs> Like, I want that so bad. <laughs> I want the Samsung flip, but I, like I can't throw it away with you that can't, message. You can't flip it. Like, yeah, you can. Like, yeah, you can. Yeah. Oh, you can. But, but, but I mean, the thing is, it's green. Yeah, this will shatter. You can't, you can't do it too. Oh. 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 I don't know. It's kind of cute, but I can't bring myself to switch. Yeah, I need the iMessage. Like, that's the only reason. I need iMessage. Okay. I just can't I don't want with to be the, the one camera person. quality that is seen the by other people. The camera quality can be good. It's not that bad. Good. It's good. That. Yeah, like it's recently it's been good. good. Yeah, like mean? their concert zoom stuff. Like that's well, really I, I just that. mean like <laughs> when you post on like Instagram or something, you can easily tell that it's from the same song. No, mm -hmm. I don't think so. Really? Mm -hmm. uh, especially in the stories. Okay, the entire Stray Kids just switched to Samsung and the quality didn't change. So that's the only reason. <laughs> they could <laughs> easily be using an iPhone. But the sponsorship won't let them. But they. But Hard okay. Life. <laughs> But a lot of K-pop <laughs> stars, a lot of K-pop stars say they're using Samsung, and then like they would have like that's a, valid, yeah. Like a I controversy. Oh my god, I brought an iPhone on the on the stage or something. Okay, the BTS <laughs> me. <laughs> I don't even like. Why BTS? do you have so many? I don't know. So oh, I hate BTS. Oh yeah, I was doing the wrong one. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> but what about you, Luna? How was your what was the digital life? Oh, yeah, digital life? Maybe yeah. your life story. Well, life story right I now. I never had any like technology till like sixth grade. 
-hmm. That's when I got like an iPod. And mm -hmm. I got an iPod touch. Yeah. Oh. yeah. That was green. blue. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, that's the only thing I use. Like, I use CDs until high school. C CD? Yeah, I have a very large <laughs> CD. <laughs> I have a lot of CDs. Did you have social media? Like, yeah, I had Kick. I don't know if you. Oh my that. god! I logged into my Kick a couple of days ago. No, I mean, like, what? Okay. It's like messaging, oh. like WhatsApp, but uh, like everyone had that. I was yeah, like, no, really? it. it was like Snapchat, but like back then. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I got Snapchat and then stuff like that. But that's the only thing I had in middle school, and then an iPhone five. That's it. Yeah. I mean. For me, I'm kind of glad because my parents waited so they didn't have to put like parental controls on all my stuff. I don't know if you guys got parental controls. No. Oh, uh, well, <laughs> never mind then. <laughs> that goes my argument. <laughs> oh. I don't know about this. You can have it. You can have it. No, that's it. Go ahead. Thank you, guys. I'm very hungry. <laughs> well, I'm not anymore. I'm tripping. Okay. <laughs> Dude, you're just going to keep saying it. I'm one. very hungry. Let's <laughs> 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 see effort. Thank you, guys. There you go. <laughs> Any other arguments about? Um, I guess well, what's the correct way? Hmm? What's the correct way of dealing with digital access and kids? I Give think your kids digital stuff in middle school, but put protections on it. I think it really like mm -hmm. I'd be at restaurants and I'd see like babies with like iPads, like you know, like the high chairs, and like that yeah. makes me kind of sad. I don't like seeing that. And it's like the kids like, even in grocery stores, like in the little cart, I'll see like a kid with like a big ass like screen. And like iPads, I'm just like, fucking talk to the kid. Like yeah. not, you, you know what I'm saying? I get you. Yeah. But um, I mean, the, but the bright side is that they can learn so much. Yeah, That's but true. like, we all learned a lot. I mean, we're not stupid. But we could learn more. Yeah, but like, yeah, they the, they have more access to like apps that they can learn from. Yeah. Okay, but like, like those that's like, how I taught my cousin. Okay. We're fully functioning people that we didn't need to look at. A yeah, but the people in, in the 1800s childhood. were fully functioning people, and they ate lead and mercury. So yeah, our but we're, too. Some families are doing that. Like they're giving their children like good apps to like for their kids, yeah. but some aren't. They're just like this is a distraction. It. Yeah, and yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. And I feel like that's it's like. I feel like it's like lazy parenting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like just use the let this teach you, let this be your parent. You know, I, that's yeah. what bothers me. But I guess there's like a limit to it because mm -hmm. there's no way that you can be a consistent good parent mm -hmm. without a break. Yeah, well, of course, I agree with that. But it's like babysitters. Like what? Have, you know, it's like, but like uh, you can't trust a person. Yeah. Hmm? As you a can't trust people. myself. They're probably making them watch cartoons. I was not allowed to let the kid watch cartoons or have oh. the iPad unless he like really cried. Mm. Which is valid. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know. Like, you just can't trust a babysitter yeah. unless you've actually checked. Yeah. Bro, some people out here be crazy. Mm. Not me though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep my job. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that was. I was it depends on the age, like if they're really young then, but... Also, I just realized yeah. that I charged way less than I should have. Like I didn't even charge minimum wage. I charged $10. An hour? Oh my yeah. god. For kids? I know. So no, you got yeah, no. No, double it or something. I have a babysit in a few years, so next time I do it's going to be 15, 20. You know, yeah. Watch out. No, double it up. Yeah, mm -hmm. for real. Yeah, 20. 20. Kids be... Smell it. I hate, I hate being on <laughs> 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 they, they give me such an ick. They're so dirty. It just depends on the on on, on the kid. Can't do it. Yeah. Hey. Hey. <laughs> you know what? Hey. Like, they, they 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 do this. They go like for the hair. Maybe it's because their fingers don't move as well as they would like to. I know, but it's like so aggressive. They're like. <laughs> 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 Sorry. <laughs> you always have deep cracks. Yeah. There's something wrong with me. No, we just have a lot of air in there. Naturally. <laughs> 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 Airhead. <laughs> Sorry. <Those are> my... <laughs> that is true, actually. I'm kind of a it's... idiot. It's okay. No, you can't say that to yourself. 
I mean, I'm good at a few things. No, you can't say too. I'm good at a lot of things. There you go. Okay. How's <laughs> yeah. affirmation? No, I'm very. I know I'm smart. It's just there's I, I like it in some other things. Yeah, but if you say idiot, your brain cannot differentiate. They're just gonna be like, okay, yeah, I'm an idiot. No, hey, 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 you're not. Hey, take it back. Take it back. <laughs> take it back. Erase it. <laughs> take it back. Okay. Do you believe? Did you smack <laughs> Do you believe in affirmations? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I do. I do. Like, you I don't do them, but I, I believe in them. You do them? No. Fake it so you make it is the realest thing in the world. Like, yeah. I thought really I thought thing. it was fake, but it's actually... It's really real. It's real. Like... Yeah. I can't think of a... <laughs> Look, come back to us. Look. Yeah, come back. It's drifting. Oh, I am. Come back. <laughs> Tomorrow or like for the future or whatever, but like sometimes it makes me feel good. That's what I. That's oh, what yeah, I'm that's important. Just to make me feel good. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like you gotta be specific. Yeah. Really? You have yeah. to have like a very clear picture of how you want something, to, and then like it's it, it's there. And then like the just, Barbie like, quote where they're like, imagine the it student becomes in a teacher. Yep. Oh, oh. You do it, and then it'll do it. What did you say? <laughs> Barbie spy movie where there are spies and then she goes like imagine the picture in your head and like imagine it over and over and then you'll be able to do it if you like picture it first like Ooh, manifestation yeah manifest mm. Whoa. Barbie telling me to manifest Whoa, that's crazy mm -hmm. <laughs> that's true good job Barbie yeah. what is your favorite Barbie movie everyone I remember Barbie remember. spy like the spy Barbie. okay <laughs> I think it's the fairy one right? oh, oh, Whichever one has that weird portal entrance where there's the waterfall. <laughs> Do you even know what the <laughs> movie is? <laughs> it's Barbie. It's, it's Barbie. like it's like all of the sisters and then there's seven and they're like going to circle. Oh. It kinda of looks like a cult. Yeah, um what should I call it? Uh, is it the dancing one? Dance uh, no, because they're like The ballerina ones. one? I don't know. No, there's several of those. Um there's like Swan Lake Barbie, but it's not Swan Lake Barbie. It's um Seven Dancing Princesses Barbie? Maybe. Yeah. There's like seven. Yeah. <laughs> Multiple yeah. Barbies. Uh, she's the queen of the way. And, and she's fucking surfing. And then she, her mom is like the mermaid queen. And then there's like an evil one. And then she's like, your daughter better not come on her 18th birthday or some shit. <laughs> and then like she goes. And then when she, what was it? When, not until when she hits water. It's like H2O type shit. Type where she like goes into water and then she gets her tail, oh. and then yeah. I like the rock star one. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> oh, the the pink star. and the purple. Yeah. 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 I like that one. <laughs> I remember the scene at the tower. <gasps> oh my god. Do you have anything in your mouth? <laughs> yeah, I had the coconut water. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're, about to, they're about to fight. <laughs> we always fight. We duke it out. I hate Pati. I'm joking. <laughs> okay. Are we reaching the end? Mm. I'm like, you know we when you eat a lot of food? Mm. And you get food coma! It's called the itis. Food okay. coma! What? The itis. I've never heard of it. I don't okay. think it's food coma. What? It's yeah, like when coma. you eat a lot and then you, you get, get sleepy. sleepy. That's food coma. What's food coma? What is itis? What is that supposed to be? Okay, I don't know, but that's what it is. <laughs> okay. It's the uh, itis. Comment down below if it's called food coma or itis. Everyone's they're going to agree with yeah. us. No, they're not. <laughs> I've never heard it called food coma. You, I'm not asleep. Okay, I'm asleep. Yeah, you are. Yeah, okay, <laughs> but like coma is like terminal. Like you might not. Well, <laughs> you're in a coma because you're going to sleep for a long time because of food. Yeah, okay, but it's I always not literal. Like an hour. It's not literal. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be the end of the video. <laughs> food coma or itis? You can food like, coma. subscribe if food coma. <laughs> oh like god. if itis. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> Just comment down below to. Just comment down below. Which one do you prefer? Um, but also you can answer any of the questions. We yeah. kind of jumped around, but yeah. it's okay. It's fine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and Enjoy. I'll see you guys next time.
Comment down below, uh, shout out Hey Army. <laughs> If you made it this no, far, no, actually, that would be good for your algorithm. Uh, comment down below. Oh my god. If you made it this far, comment Saturn Hey Army Purple. Hashtag it too, so that like purple, BTS fans find it because you know they're good. They're good for us. I purple you. Is that what they say? I don't know. Purple Army. <laughs> <laughs> comment Get that algorithm, Jungkook. Jungkook. <laughs> it was only his one. name. R M. J Hope. J Hope. Suga. Comment Suga down it. below. Jimin. Oh, there we go. Comment right. Suga down below. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Cover the camera lens. And oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah.